So hello everybody and happy Monday. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can trim column headers where you have spaces in between the words using just one step. Are you ready? Let's get started. Okay guys, so this is a request from Vida after she said my eight tips and tricks for column header transformation. So I'm going to post a link down below to that video too. But here I'm going to show you, she asked me, okay, how, how do I do when I have spaces between words? As you probably know, trim in Power Query only trims the spaces in the beginning and the end. There is no function that actually would do in the middle or like everywhere. So for that, we need to create one ourselves. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you step by step how the thing works. And then we're going to put everything together in just one go. Okay. So step by step, here we have, we have country name, country flag, and as you can see here, I have blanks in between and we want to get rid of those. So what we're going to do is demote this thing. So put the column header as the first row. Let's remove this change type. I'm going to then transpose you what we needed to be. You don't need to do that afterwards, but just to show you, we need to do this. And what we're going to do is add a custom column. And here we're going to split the text by spaces. So we want to have a list that contains all the words in, in one row. Lists don't have rows, but in one place. I'll, I'll show you. Let me show you. Text split is actually easier than explaining with words. This column one where the column headers are. And we want to split these where there are spaces in there. Okay. And I'll show you what it does in just a second. Do you see there that it creates a list where you have words and spaces separate? Okay, so what we want to do now is to get rid of these um, cells where there are blanks and just keep the words. So we're going to do like this custom column and then we're going to do list select from the column that contains the list, which is the custom column. And then we're going to do for each uh, row, go and pick the cells where we don't have null values. And as you can see here, it creates the list and it removes the null values. And what we need to do now is to actually put these lists, as uh, so these words together with a space in between just one. Or maybe you don't want the space you choose but it is power query you should have spaces anyhow so let me show you we go to another column and we say text combine and then we're going to put the last one that doesn't have it and then we're going to combine with a space in between and check what it does okay so now you see the three steps that we need to take and we can put all of these together in one go, okay? So you don't have to do all that stuff and all these types of uh, steps. And to do it in one go, you just go here and you write table transform column names and then the previous step. And then you put these things together. The only thing that you need to change is in the first text it's split instead of having the column, you have to put each. So it goes through each of the column headers. So this is the way the... Uh, this is the, the code that you need to use in M in order to clean inner text or outer text. It will clean everything, basically. So it will trim everything. How cool is that in one go? So I hope you enjoyed the trick. I will see you again on Wednesday as always. So until then, take care, stay healthy, stay home, stay safe. And bye-bye. See you on Wednesday.